Hello, what about within the within the club? I think you've got about 17 players contracted for next season. Uh, is there anyone that isn't contracted as yet that, that you'd like to, to make sure they stay, stick with the club? Uh, well, we have started uh, our talks with, uh, with all of them. Uh, there's a three that are coming out of contract. Obviously, uh, Issei, uh, he is the one. Uh, but he has indicated that he wants to leave, he wants to go uh, back overseas. Uh, the other two are Met Mandi and Adnan Mohammed. So uh, I will be talking to them um, in the next uh, few days and just to see what, uh, what their uh, thoughts are. And then we'll go, we'll go from there. As I say, you've served under a, a number of coaches, Miran Bleiberg, Frank Farina, of course, Ange Postacoglu, all with very different styles themselves. How do you see your own style developing as a coach? Uh, well, you know, and, uh, as an as assistant coach, you really need to adapt to whoever is, uh, you know, the leading man. And uh, uh, I try to adapt to all of, uh, all of those uh, coaches that, that you mentioned. So, um, obviously, Ainge being the last coach that I had to work with uh, had the biggest influence on me. And uh, I'm really happy that I had a chance and opportunity to work with Ainge. And uh, his leadership, uh, uh, his philosophy has really been something that uh, um, I have embraced and uh, I'm looking forward to develop that even further. Rado, uh, generally the assistant coaches tend to get a little bit closer to players in some circumstances. Uh, keeping that in mind, will it be tough for you now to make some tough calls at training if someone's not performing? Do you need, do you need to now create some distance between yourself and the players? Um, not, not really. We, we do have a fantastic culture here at the club and the uh, players have got respect for each other and for coaching staff. So, you know, although sometimes uh, us coaches, we do make some silly decisions and some wrong calls, uh, players, they, are, they accept that and that there should be no problems at training sessions. Uh, obviously, you know, if, uh, if you think about uh, substitutions throughout the games, of course, sometimes players get a little bit upset, but that's just the heat of the moment and they have to deal with it. Open, free-flowing and attacking football, very much the flavour of Ange Postacoglu. Do you see that continuing next season under yourself? Of course, yeah. No, nothing will change. We will continue uh, the same philosophy. We will continue what, is, what has been very successful style. So, as I said, we are going to, we are definitely trying to even develop further. So, you know, from our offensive and our defensive game. And, um, you know, that will be a good challenge for us uh, because, obviously, uh, this year, many clubs that we played against them, they would, they would change their game. They would, they would concentrate on how to stop us. So, we need to come.